What's going on everybody? It's the Beastly Gamer here. I wanted to talk to you guys today about Jack Tretton. If you guys don't know who Jack Tretton is, he's a CEO of Sony Computer Entertainment America. He's been with Sony for almost 20 years and uh, he's stepping down from his position and handing the reins off to a new guy. Now, uh, if you don't know who he is, there will be a link in the description showing you probably his most famous moment at E3 2013 last year when he announced that the PlayStation 4 was just going to be pretty much the same as the PlayStation 3 as far as the way they interacted with the consumer. This set the world into an uproar because uh, Microsoft tried to change the game and, and instill restrictive DRM policy. But this article is on GamesRadar.com. I'm going to go ahead and let you guys hear it now. So, PlayStation boss leaves Sony. What does this mean for PlayStation 4? Jack Tretton, president and CEO of Sony Entertainment America, will leave Sony on March 31st. That's big news. Jack is the boss. I usually leave the stories about men in suits swapping employers to hard news sites, but this could have a significant impact on the PlayStation division. Tretton has been involved with Sony for 19 years. He's one of the founding members of the PlayStation division. So what is this move likely to mean for the PS4? Well, Trenton has certainly given the console the best start possible. A veteran of six console launches, he has been instrumental in winning the PR battle against Microsoft when it counts. Reports show that the PlayStation 4 has had a better launch than the Xbox One. Duh. Despite the fact that both consoles launched in the same month, Trenton leaves his successor Sean Layden with a significant amount of momentum. Now, I don't know what else he could have done besides what he has done to give the PlayStation 4 the best poss possible uh, send-off of a console probably in history. This thing is, um, it, it looks like it's set to be the number one selling console of all time and a lot of that has to do with the actual E3 that took place last year. I mean, um, you guys, I'm sure most of you have seen it. When he went up on that stage and he started to announce the things that Sony was not going to change, the crowd, these people are reporters, these people are news and media, they went nuts like they were rabbit gamers, they went crazy like we, like they were us. So that lets you know the kind of energy that this E3 that Tretton put on sent out to the world. I was at work, I was watching it on my laptop, and I went crazy at work, and I felt a bond to this band because he came across like, hey look, we're here for you, the gamers, and it meant a lot. So Mr. Layden, he's in a great position. Uh, to push the PlayStation 4 forward. I don't see where they can go wrong. They seem to have a really well put together plan. The console is priced perfectly. It's very powerful. There's really not much more that he need to do. I just want to say to Mr. Tredden, thank you for your, your hard service with Sony. You've been instrumental in changing many lives, myself included. I remember when PlayStation first came out, I was mind blown. And I want to thank you for your part in that. I'm sure a lot of my subscribers do too. You guys leave a comment. Let me know what you think about this. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.